Well, what's up everyone? In this video, the next capital city I'm about to draw is going to be Dallas, Texas. April Fools, that's not the actual capital of Texas. The actual capital of Texas is Austin, Texas. This one is going to be really, really exciting because, yeah, it's a very popular capital city uh, in the U.S. So, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get to work. Austin, Texas is part of the top 20 largest U.S. cities by population. It's the fourth largest Texas city by population. This city is right behind Dallas, San Antonio, and Houston. Austin is the second largest capital city in the U.S. It's the southernmost state capital in the contiguous U.S. or United States. It's considered to be a beta global city. It's part of the Globalization and World Cities Research Network. The earliest humans was when they... The earliest humans lived in Central Texas area during the Ice Age, the Late Ice Age, by the way. The Native Americans have been fishing and hunting along the creeks, including the Barton Springs. Then the European settlers started coming by and they've been establishing a bunch of missions. Specifically, these European settlers are the Spanish settlers. The ending of Mexico's independence, ever since the ending of Mexico's independence from Spain, the Anglo-Americans made Texas become a huge thing, and they made their way to the central Texas area. Then there was this first permanent settlement in the area that dates to the 1830s. And then there was this village called Waterloo. Uh, spoiler, Waterloo was the original name uh, before Austin, Texas became an existing city. We had Waterloo. Uh, and that village got founded by the Colorado River. And the Shoal Creek, I'm not sure if I said the S word right. I'm not good with names. I've been saying that millions and millions of times. By 1836, when the Texas Revolution came to an end, the Republic of Texas became independent. Then there were some temporary capitals of the Republic. This city, uh, the city got incorporated and renamed to Austin. Uh, it's named after Stephen F. Austin. He's nicknamed the father of Texas. And this all started, this was during uh, 1839, the year 1839. Eventually in 1845, the Republic of Texas got annexed to the US and became the capital of Texas in 1846. Uh, Austin became the capital in 1846. The city of Austin, Texas has some well-known bodies of water such as the Lady Bird Lake, Lake Travis on Colorado River, Barton Springs, McKinney Falls, and Lake Walter E. Long. The city is one of the fastest growing in the U.S. It's one of the fastest growing cities in the U.S. and I think it still is to this day. Its motto is Keep Austin Weird. Honestly, this motto is weird and unique simultaneously. The city is nicknamed ATX, Live Music Capital of the World, 
Silicon Hills, and the city of the Violent Crown. A lot of Twitch streamers actually uh, live in this city, believe it or not. I've been noticing that. A lot of famous, popular streamers live in this city. And the city has several headquarters slash offices, such as 3M, AMD, which stands for Advanced Micro Devices, Amazon, Apple, Facebook, Google, IBM, Intel, Oracle, Texas Instruments, Whole Foods Markets, and I'm also going to include Dell's. Uh, this, the headquarter of Dell's, is located in the suburb of Austin, Texas. Austin has some very popular places, such as the Congress Avenue Bridge, Deep Eddy Pool. Fun fact about this public pool, this is the oldest public pool in the state of Texas. Texas State Capitol, Frank Urine Center, I'm not sure if I said the last name right. Again, I'm not good with names. St. Edwards University, Austin Community College, Lake Austin. Laguna Gloria, Darrell K. Royal, Texas Memorial Stadium, Paramount Theater, Q2 Stadium, it's home of the Austin FC, uh, a major league soccer team, or a soccer team, um, and last but not least, University of Texas at Austin. This is one of, it's a very popular university, it's one of the biggest schools in the US like it's tremendously popular and yeah I forgot to mention, the University of Texas at Austin is home of the Texas Longhorns, which it's a pretty popular sports team uh, for a, a very popular university that's located in the U.S. City of Austin 
has it's the birthplace of these famous people such as actors Amber Heard, Ethan Hawke, and Angus T. Jones, rapper Nelly, activists Lizzie Velasquez, and Claire Win Wineland, R.I.P., wrestlers Dustin Rhodes, and Dusty Rhodes, R.I.P., as well. I did the drawing of Austin, Texas, I didn't really struggle whatsoever. It wasn't a pain in the rear end. It was just a straightforward job for me to get past. I had no problems at all. Not a single issue. Well, I take that back. I did face a very few issues. A couple issues, actually. Uh, the perspective of the drawing, it's slightly off. The buildings are slightly off. Uh, I, the trees are fine. I drew the trees however way I wanted. I just drew the trees right uh, properly. The trees are good. The river is good. But the bridge, that one bridge that's that's the closest. I should have made it. I should have pushed it further. I should have made the bridge go further. I should have drew it further, but oh well. Uh, and I did love the shading of the drawing. I also, the sky is fine. I love how I did the sky. I felt like I should have added a couple clouds, but adding a couple clouds with a black ink pen, that, I feel like that's a bit challenging. But you know, it is what it is. I still... Love the look of the drawing. Yeah, the 
this took a little over two hours. Closer look. Austin, Texas, everyone. So that is going to be the end of this video. Stay tuned for more content and I hope this video was quite enjoyable to watch. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate your time. Feel free to subscribe to this channel. Feel free to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I love to connect with you people. And also, feel free to follow my Facebook page. So, I will catch each and every one of you guys later.